Hello and welcome back to Tomb Raider. We're going to see what Lara Croft is up to today. So last time we basically went through the intro up until we kind of had the bow tutorial. So let's keep on a going and we're going to see where we can get her to. Alright, here's where we got all the bow stuff. Might as well pick up some arrows. Oh, that door's open. So we can probably go in there now. Hey, is someone in here? This door wasn't open earlier. No? Okay. Got a nice little torch. One of Laura's go-to tools in this game. Oh no! The door shut. You just assumed that it was locked. Alright, drop to mount ladder. Let's mount the ladder and head on down. And I got some, uh, sad news on next week's Steam Deck performance video. My original plan was to play Gundam Evolution, the new Gundam first person shooter that just came out on Steam. I'm still trying to get that game to work. It's giving me an error message asking if I'm launching the game from the correct installer whenever I boot it up. But it uses easy anti-cheat so it might not work on the Steam Deck without installing Windows. I'm gonna try it in desktop mode and try a few different Proton variants, but... Oh god, this is insane. Yeah, I'm working on that. This is insane. What's insane? Oh, yeah. All this. This is a creepy place. Let's see what's in here. Nothing. Okay. Can't open that. Ooh, we need new equipment for that. So let's see what we can do here. Let's light all this on fire. That definitely won't upset all of these people. Alright. There's our tool. Probably one of the most useful tools in this new trilogy. Well, doesn't always look like that. But the axe is a great tool in this, in these games, because they're help how you open doors. I mean, they do open doors, but they help you climb. None of that look for a ledge nonsense. We can pu jump up in any climbable wall. We can just slap that axe into and climb all we want. It's a pretty nice feature. And it, uh, kind of makes sense since a lot of the older Tomb Raider games just assumed that you knew oh there's a ladder here but it just kind of like assumed like oh hey look all of these ruins just happened to the fade away to have these perfect handholds for Lara to get all the way through this area mm-hmm Yep, uh, yeah, that's, that's totally believable. Alright, let's put the... Oh. Oh. There's people here. Where's the, uh, sneak button? No, not that one. That's jump. Is there a sneak button? No, that's with changing weapons. It's fine. It's fine. We'll sneak up on whoever's over here. No, I can't really hear much. Boy, I have... Sam, um, oh! Hello! It's okay. I seem to have misplaced my remote Sorry my TV. That's you. unfortunate. This place would make anyone there it is. Jumpy. We just spoke to your crew. They're on their way. Look, he damaged my foot. Oh, it was the oh you I injured did. your foot. So did anybody else get dragged into a cave? Sorry, I'm Matthias, a teacher by trade. Okay, I don't trust you. Not really cut out for island life, I'm afraid. <laughs> well, that's unfortunate because you're stuck on an island. Yeah. Sam here was just telling me about the sun. 
Right, Himiko. Oh, Himiko. Can you tell me more? I'm in Let's learn about H Queen Himiko. Well, believe it or not, a couple thousand years ago, Queen Himiko pretty much ran things in Japan. <sighs> she loves telling this story. Himiko was beautiful, enigmatic, but also ruthless and powerful. Legend says she had shamanistic powers. And this is where she loses. Well, there's always some truth to miss. She commanded an army of samurai warriors, her magnificent storm guard. They rode the very winds into battle, laying waste to all who opposed them. They say the sun rose at Himiko's command, and she ruled everything its rays touched, from the mountains to the sea. So did she only rule stuff for like 12 hours at a time? And Lara's out. Oh! I'm awake! And everybody's gone. That's unfortunate. They left me! Oh no! Is that a bear trap? Oh no! Oh. Oh no. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. No time to get out of the trap. There is only time to wait and see. Wolves, you're not going to come out and attack me, are you? Not today, wolf! You know what this reminds me of? There is a section like this at the beginning of Resident Evil Revelations 1 on Chris's campaign where I think he like falls down a hill or something. And he is stuck down and I think there's I think there are dogs or some kind of monsters attacking him. Like the entire time he's like, yeah, Chris can't can't just stand up or anything. I think it was Chris. It was either Chris or his partner in that game. That uh, girl partner. I don't remember her name either. I only played Revelations a couple times. All right, well, wolves are down. Bear traps are still clenched into her leg. Hey, get this bear trap off me. It kind of hurts. Uh, oh, it, it conveniently is one of the ones that didn't have teeth. So she's not injured. No, I don't want to go with him. You know how to use one of these? It's, it's been a while. It, it's all coming back to me. Get to Roth. We'll find Sam and this Matthias guy. That's the archaeologist that was mad at Laura on the boat. You gonna be okay? Yes. I'll be fine. Oh, we just need to rest for a few minutes. Oh, like a campfire. I think this is the area of the game where we get access to costumes. So I'll finally be able to get her into my favorite outfit for her. Uh, you sit here. Well, uh, technically there's a pretty good outfit you unlock when you beat the game. Okay. It's kind of got the blues and has like a classic Tomb Raider look to it. But there's another one that I bought in DLC that I really like. Do I have access to it now? No, not yet. Alright, get up. And let's go. We'll definitely get there in this episode, though. I think. Oh, he's... Alright. We're gonna pick up some bu some arrow... Oh, I got I'm full on arrows, so we're fine. Not today, wolf! Oh, okay. Alright, alright, alright. Fine. Fine, be that way. Yeah. What you gonna do now? Nothing. 
He could have warned you about the wolves. Hold on. I'm uh, being a little preemptive here. Because this is the area where you're introduced to uh, upgrading. And we gotta grab stuff from this. Oh look, it's deer. Hmm. Alright, fine. I won't worry about you then. Aha, and the instincts still highlight these boxes even though we don't have them in our objectives yet. Alright. I'm pretty sure we needed like nine of these boxes. So I'm gonna grab one from over here. Who are they worshipping? Um Hold on. Let's light our torch. And we'll light this. This should reveal some more. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Alright. Let's head up. Oh, hold on. There's another one over here. With more arrows. 60. Yeah, head up this way. That was rude. Ah, crap. Get off! That was lucky! Hitting the right button there was pure accident. I did not expect them to do a QTE there. I mean, I knew they did from that, this area from when I did my initial Steam Deck testing, but still. Alright. 70. You know, I'll go ahead and go this way, see if there's another one of those boxes over here. I know there's more wolves up this way, because I think over here there is a... path you can go up, and then there's more wolves that pop out. There's bunnies. I won't kill the bunnies. There we go. 90. I think that will get us what we need. Jump back over here. Now let's talk to him. You know, it's funny. If that's enough, it pays to be prepared. Because I think normally, the last time I did this... What's this? A stronger axe is needed to open. Okay. Okay. And I think that's also what we need up here for this door. Alright. Jerk. Yes, they are. I've seen these before. Oh, they must be ritualistic. This, this female image is particularly interesting. Looks like it was made quite recently. It's by those islanders, no doubt. Judging by the wrecks out there, they were once like us. Survivors. Remarkable. Yes, well let's He's marking out. Murderers too. See if you can work the other one. Um, okay. Let's calm down there, Professor. Together. Oh shit. It won't take the fall. I'll have to find something sturdier to turn it with. Must be something around here we can use. Oh, there is. Incredible. Even though we're really just gonna upgrade the axe. See if I can fix this axe. Find a camp and upgrade the axe. Alright. Upgrading time. Salvage. Use collected salvage, which is the stuff we've been collecting from those boxes, to upgrade gear and weapons in the gear menu. So we got So basically, yeah, use nine use fifty. I got way more than I needed. That's fine. Upgrade installed. Cool. Since we have access to gear now, 
Outfits! I knew it! So what do we got? There's default and sure shot. So default is equipped, sure shot is equipped now. And as we'll see here in a minute, it's it looks super good. Yeah, look at that. Super good. I love this outfit. All right, Professor. I'm right. Oh, actually, hold on. That box said it would need an upgraded thing, too. So I wonder if we can open this now. Yeah, buddy. I almost missed out on... Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Well, that's disappointing. Just a bunch of old, rusted-out parts. I guess it's just there just to let you know, oh, hey, you should look out for these boxes, too. Yeah, I'm ready. Let's go. Also, I'm thinking of running these episodes a little bit longer since we're only doing one game episode per week. So if you have a problem with that, let me know in the comments below. We're not going to go crazy here, but maybe like go 30 minutes instead of 20 minutes. Elemental power. Sooner or later, it gets called witchcraft. We shouldn't discount anything, even what may seem to us irrational. We yeah, you're gonna start uh, agreeing with that, Lara Croft. It could be one hell of a story. Lara. It's unfortunate they they never put the legend story into this trilogy. You know, from Tomb Raider Legend, that was really cool. What they did with the King Arthur story. There's a reason I kept replaying it on my PSP, despite the fact that it only ran at like 15 to 20 FPS on that platform. But look, the bowl, the candles. Why is she still being worshipped? This island, it must have once been part of Yamatai. You were right, Laura. The oh, really? I was right! But this is real. And you were wrong! Hmm. We're standing on a gold mine! Hmm. Come, quickly. Your friends are hurt. Yes, probably by them. Get back. They can't be trusted. He's gonna get shot because he doesn't know how to handle a gun. Have a gun. Shoot him! I don't want any trouble. No. We'll come. No. But I insist that afterwards you take us to whoever's in charge. What are you doing? Be quiet. You are being a dum dum. She's like, I got this. Oh wait, no, I don't. Just, just go along with them, Laura. Russian dudes? Okay then. Who are you people? What's you doing with us? Laura! If they think you're in trouble, kill them! Don't hurt them, please! Don't you touch me. Oh! That's unfortunate. I want a QTE to like kick her, hit him, or something, for how he was touching her. That was uh, no bueno. Oh yay, stealth! Isn't this fun? Let's stealth around for a, for a few minutes until we can get these bindings off. Do, 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 do. Anything? You see nothing. Oh, Alright, let's go hide up in here. You saw nothing! You saw nothing. New recruits. So these probably aren't the islanders. Maybe another group that's arrived here. What do you see? Uh, nothing. That's right, you see nothing. You don't see a girl right here in bright red. Well, maybe not bright red. It's kind of like a... Not really a maroon red, but it's kind of like slightly darker red. It'll be a 
Sneaking, 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 sneaking. Just keep hiding, Laura. No one escapes. Just keep. Oh no! I've been caught. Whatever will Laura do? Um, my bad. I wasn't quick enough on the trigger. Let's try that again. Strangled to death. Back off! Back off! Oh yeah! Bite him! Oh, look a gun. Wait, how did that come off? Shoot him in the dick! There's no way you can you can still move like that. There is no way after I shot you in the dick. That guy would be on the ground. Well, he dead now. And now she's freaking out because she killed a d killed someone. Oh, don't worry, Laura. You will not be bothered by this for long. You know, thinking about them not doing Legend, I keep thinking about the PS2 trilogy and feel that it's sad that they never did any of those storylines. Like, Underworld was, uh, okay. But Anniversary, like the original game storyline, was really good. What they did with Atlantis. They never brought, they never did that. Because, I mean, what they did was interesting. Because... Well... I can't really say the interesting parts of Rise of the Tomb Raider because it's big spoilers, but she, but Lara finds something really cool in that game, and then they did a uh, did a fun twist on I don't remember if it was the Mayan apocalypse or something. They did they did a twist on one uh, one culture's ap apocalypse in Shadow of the Tomb Raider, which was pretty neat. Did you just Neo Matrix dodge a bullet? Oh, wow. Wow. Good on you, Laura. And now, time to die, boys. Shenanigans. Hey, 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 guess what? Yeah, you shot. Now you're dead. Let's swap back over to the bow. We'll start looting these enemies, see what we can loot out of them. Let's see, five bullets, cool. More bullets. And even more bullets, guess what? They were like, oh yeah, you got plenty of bullets. Oh, we don't have any, we don't have any arrows. Let's look around and see if we can find some arrows. Hmm, can't really go back that way. Because if I'm not going to one-shot them either way... Hurry. 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 Oh. QTEs! Were QTEs still such a huge deal when this game was made? This game was made in like 2013? Surely that was getting out of all of that. Not that it's a bad thing, I don't mind QTEs at all. Oh yeah, buddy. How I many we got? Seven. Seven's not great, but it's a start. Now we can do a silent kill by shooting them with... Dang! And he fell off! Nice! 
All right, let's keep moving. I don't want to go too slow because we do need to get to a campfire so we can save. Oh, looks like I'm uh, full on ammo on the pistol, which means the pistol's max is... Oh, wow, 50. Yeah, I've got a lot. Jump! All right, let's keep going around. And even with combat going on, we're still running at 60. On what? Well, we're on high settings, right? Normal and high. Yeah, this is excellent. So what came in? Another tanker? Nah, look like some kind of research. Should Let's wait for them stuff? to keep talking. Maybe one of them will leave. We got a crew towing it in now. Think we'll get any new recruits out of this one? Fuck, man, I don't know. Because I know, I think this is the area where if you don't kill them quickly. There we go. Because there's one area up here, like if you don't kill them, kill the guys up there. Okay? Yep, yep, this is it. This is, this is, this is, uh, this is it. There he goes. No, this isn't what I'm thinking of. What I am thinking of is an area where. You got two guys on the left, and if you don't take them out quickly, there's a bunch of guys will come in from the right. Lada, are you there? Yes. Yep. I can see smoke coming from the old ruins. Are you okay? Oh God, Roth, I'm in trouble. I, I killed somebody. Actually, I killed a bunch what? of people there. Who? Men. I don't know why. Russian I dudes. Some of them. I have no choice. Did you know the Russians always have to be portrayed as evil people, it's even before all of the uh, You've got to warn the other recent side. stuff happened oh, with Russia? You just do whatever it takes to get to me, Lana. Oh, I will. I'll kill all these guys. Oh, hey, look, parts. Give me that. Ooh, 170. Cool. Let's see here. We've got. Hmm. Probably shouldn't go over there. Actually, hold on. Uh, that is not what I wanted to do, but okay. Yeah, let's just come back up here. I was hoping I could just hang off the edge and see if there's anything down there. You know, like you look down there and it's like, oh, that's us. That's a yeah. That's that's a no bueno path. And then if you like hung down there and looked and be like, oh, hey, there's actually a uh, hmm. some kind of container. Oh, there we go. Collectible on this side. What we got here? Experience. New camp discovered. Sweet. So this is where we're gonna end the day today. We unlock fast travel so we can go between campsites. Go to gear. Anything we can... Handgun upgrade, bow upgrades. No. Uh, nope, not enough salvage for that. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Go back into it. There's another one. Go back. Nope, we'll probably have to do the outfits. No, that's just outfits we've unlocked. No more upgrades for you. And I don't have enough port vented slider slide required so I don't have the uh, stuff for that either all right that's fine I guess I do have a skill point so let's spend that real quick uh, hunt let's do hunter upgrades steady shot sounds amazing hold charged bow shots for double the time okay There's our save. Let's see what that means. Okay, whatever. Well, anyways, we just saved. So that's going to be it for today's episode of Tomb Raider. We're going to catch up with Lara Croft next week. As always, thank you for watching, and have a great day.